return to your home. A curfew is in effect. Please return to your home. A curfew is in effect. Get ready for Q-Star AI. It's the latest tech sensation that's set to change everything. Think of a place where smarts are endless and new ideas never stop. We're about to explore the world of Q-Star AI, where every secret leads to something amazing. In November 2023, Sam Altman was removed from his position as CEO of OpenAI. Sam Altman is an entrepreneur and investor who is best known for his role as the CEO of OpenAI, the organization behind ChatGPT. Shortly after his removal, there was significant pushback from investors and employees. This led to negotiations and an agreement in principle for Altman to return as CEO. As part of the agreement, OpenAI's board of directors was largely replaced. The specific reasons behind the board's initial lack of confidence and the details of the resolution have not been made public. However, it is clear that Altman's leadership was valued by many within the company, leading to his swift reinstatement. Sam Altman has been a significant figure in the AI industry, and his brief firing and subsequent return as CEO of OpenAI were notable events in the world. QSTAR is a secret reason related to why Sam Altman left and returned as OpenAI's boss. It's a mystery for outsiders. You must have also wondered, what exactly is this Q-Star and how powerful it will be? Q-Star is like a brainy robot that OpenAI created. It's got some serious skills in solving math problems that it's never seen before. Kind of like a whiz kid in a math class. People are talking about it because it's not just good at math. It's also getting better and better at it, which is a big deal in the world of AI. It could even predict what might happen next. It's got everyone thinking about how it might change things for all of us. QSTAR is a type of AI that gets better by learning from people's input. It's really good at making smart choices and understanding what's going on around it. Only the folks working at OpenAI know all the things QSTAR can do it's pretty good at guessing what will happen next in different situations. Whether it's playing chess, driving a car, or figuring out who might win an election, QSTAR uses math to make really good guesses. The way QSTAR works is a big secret that only the smart people at OpenAI know. But what we do know is that it's way more advanced than other AI systems. It learns and changes its behavior kind of like a human does, which is a big step towards creating an AI that's as smart as a person. It isn't just important for science, it could change a lot of different jobs and industries because it's so good at predicting what might happen in the future. It could really change the way we make decisions in businesses, like making sure things get from point A to point B more smoothly or predicting money trends better. As QSTAR keeps getting smarter, it's really important to think about how it should be used right. We need to be careful and make sure it's not used in the wrong way or causes problems we didn't expect. We want to make sure that QSTAR helps people and does good things for the world. Sure, let me explain it in a simpler way. QSTAR is a super advanced AI that's kept under wraps by the smart folks at OpenAI. It's way smarter than the usual AI because it can learn and change its behavior just like humans do. This is a big step towards making AI that can think and act on its own. The cool thing about QSTAR is that it's not just for science experiments. It can guess what might happen in the future in different situations, which is super useful for all kinds of businesses. For example, QSTAR could help companies plan their inventory better or make smarter money decisions. This means businesses could work better, make more money, and be more successful. But as QSTAR gets better and better, we have to think about how to use it responsibly. 
we need to make sure it's used for good and doesn't cause any problems. Our main aim is to make sure QSTAR helps people and makes the world a better place. QSTAR has a lot of good points, but it could also be risky for people because we have to be careful about how we use it. It's as a really advanced AI that's on its way to being as smart as a human. It's different from ChatGPT because it doesn't just use facts it learned before. It can actually think and understand things on its own, just like we do. QSTAR is a way of teaching computers to make decisions that don't require them to know everything about the situation beforehand. It learns from experience by trying different things and seeing what works and what doesn't. This way of learning allows QSTAR to make smart decisions, much like how people think and learn from their experiences. However, this impressive feature of this new AI has become its own downfall. Researchers have become concerned about the future of mankind because of QSTAR's ability. People who make AI, like the scientists at OpenAI, say it will be able to think and reason like a person. This is exciting, but also a bit scary because we don't know everything it might be able to do. And if something goes wrong, it might be tough to fix or control it. There can also be a drawback to QSTAR. The technology is moving really fast and it might be hard for people to keep up. This could mean that a lot of people might not have the right skills for new jobs. Because of this, not everyone will be able to keep their jobs. But the answer isn't just to teach people new skills. Like in the past, some people will do well with new technology, but others will have to figure out things on their own. OpenAI is working through some tough issues with QSTAR, trying to make money while also doing the right thing. People are wondering if QSTAR can really see into the future. As AI gets better and OpenAI works towards creating super smart AI, we have to think about what this means for OpenAI's path forward and how strong AI systems like QSTAR could change things. We'll have to wait and see just how much QSTAR can do and how it might change the future of AI. For now, we're keeping our fingers crossed that it all turns out well. Let's meet again. Beyond another veil at same place, another time, maybe with another you.